So this just took place in Mississauga, Ontario, Canada. We see a white doctor. So you're saying in the whole entire building there isn't one white doctor? The kid has chest pains, he's going to have to sit here until 4 o'clock. Can I see a doctor please that's white? A white doctor? L lady, you're in Mississauga. Ain't no white people Mississauga. I've been to Mississauga, and I was the white guy. On a side note, what was she doing there? Why doesn't she go back to Toronto? I'm just joking. Ain't no white people in Toronto either. Can I see a doctor, please, that's white? That doesn't have brown teeth that speaks English. That speaks English, that doesn't have brown teeth. Without brown teeth that speak English? First of all, what does the doctor's accent have to do with their ability to treat a patient? If they're licensed, they're qualified, they got the job, it means they're knowledgeable enough to treat their patients. Second of all, what do brown teeth have to do with any of this? Are you taking a stance against immigration or are you just taking a stance against poor dental hygiene? I really do want to see how this doctor looked or how that doctor sounded like because what was so bad about this doctor that this woman practically exploded. Wow, unbelievable. Go to the hospital. 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 Going to the hospital will not solve anything because do you know where brown people also work? Hospitals. Yeah. There are doctors, nurses, paramedics, and other patients who are brown at a hospital. So she's not going to feel comfortable there <laughs> at all. Your child clearly has more issues with you being his mother than him needing to see a doctor. You are extremely rude and racist. Damn! Step okay. back. This I'm, is my personal I'm, bubble. She is your personal bubble? Oh my god. You, you, you can't just spew hate and then yell safe space it's we're not playing tag here well speaking Go english is one thing doctor? being white is different yeah that's that should you should be asking not the white uh, canadian doctor who speaks english i'm sure a lot of doctors who speak english they are not white this is my favorite part where the person holding the camera speaks to this lady in the most stereotypical southeast asian accent just to rub it in i really wish the man said something along the lines of listen to me i'm canadian and i speak english very very well for many years india was colonized by the english for a very long time okay i know what english sounds like Achha, chalo. what type of horrible country do i live in so i want to see somebody else that doesn't have brown teeth that speaks english just... i'm really interested in finding out what a 911 call from this lady would sound like i think it would go something like this hello operator Hi, yeah, like, uh, my house is currently being robbed, so if you could, like, um, you know, call the police as soon as possible to get here to save me, and, um, you know, just, 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 just one small thing, could you please make sure they're, um, not brown, like, you know, no, 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 I'm not racist, I just mean, like, no, 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 I just mean, like, um, you know, uh, no brown eyes, uh, no brown teeth, no brown skin, no brown hair, um, did not eat brown rice, but, uh, it, just, all, all white, yes, yes, you, you know what, just, just call Casper, he knows what to do, yeah, the friendly ghost, that's right. Thank you. Honestly, at the very end, I feel bad for the kid that was involved in this because the kid was physically ill and needed to see a doctor and their mother was, their mother had this discrimination disease and just would not allow her child to receive treatment because this doctor was brown or had brown teeth. It's just sad. And I don't know what stress factors she had in her life. I don't know what other external factors that resulted in this. Maybe that's not who she is. Maybe she's not a bad person. And this is just something that happened out of the ordinary. But at the end of the day, if ignorance like this could take place in a place like Mississauga, and a diverse place such as Mississauga, then ignorance like this could take place anywhere. Thank you very much for watching. And uh, for more videos, please like, follow, share, and subscribe. And until next time, assalamu alaikum and peace be with you. If this video gives you a stroke, diarrhea, constipation, internal bleeding, or any abdominal discomfort, ask your doctor if racism is right for you. Ignorance sold separately, logic not included. People are just looking at me like, oh my god, he's talking to himself in front of a camera. This is crazy. I am crazy, but they can't prove it. And if you are a very sensitive person and you're offended by my accent, and if you're offended, please let me know and I'll probably do another accent in a, from a different country. And maybe practice more next time. Yeah, I know, I'm not in a professional setting, I didn't have enough time, I'm a busy guy, I had to do it from my phone, from my uh, car, you know. <laughs> Ain't no white people in Toronto either. We're taken over. We just reproduce rapidly. Or we're educated and we find good jobs there, I don't know. By the way, a doctor could be male or female, so don't be sexist. I know you assumed it was a male, I did too. Not because I'm sexist though. Because she said something about bad teeth, and I'm pretty sure women take care of their teeth more than men. Just an assumption, not being sexist. Or am I? What's that sound? I hear sirens. They found me.